Welcome back to Tim and Unboxing. Hello, and today we are unboxing the Smile World Go for Gold or Miss Mystery Box. <laughs> so this box came out uh, August 30th and is $13 per box. Each box has one Funko Pop. So we have four boxes right here for a total of $63.75. So in this run, there was a total of 400 boxes. And the top grail is the Michael Myers glow. So I don't know if we're going to get it or not. There's a Michael Myers pop. I should have known that. There's a lot of Michael Myers. There's a lot of horror pops. You learn something new every day. Yeah. Like. And there's a lot of glow versions of them too. There's like glow Chucky. There's, there's actually a 10 inch Chucky. That's terrifying. Yeah. I don't want to get that. <laughs> because I do want to get some Chucky pops. But then I saw the 10 inch one. And I was like, you know, that's too realistic since he's yeah. like pretty much that size yeah and i just can't stare at that that's gonna give me nightmares so that's hilarious in this box i just think it's funny because like i don't know i don't know what happened here whoever yeah. dropped this off just gave it just had a fight with it just kicked it a couple times yeah, I was about to say, and ran it, away just put it on your shelf and then <laughs> kicked it a few times yeah but and uh, another thing before we get started so uh -huh. this is our first my world box and the thing i've noticed with my world is if you get a top grill it's usually wrapped in like um like paper and it has like a rubber ducky on it. That's cute. Yeah, so <laughs> we'll know if we got a top grail from that. It makes me excited. Mm -hmm. But now we have that out of the way. Leave a comment down below telling us your favorite Funko Pop that we unboxed today from our first My World Mystery Box. All right, let's see what's inside. This box is I think you're all wrapped up in paper. I think that's how you usually do it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I kind of hate this paper because it's so loud. <laughs> yeah. Like, hey, let's um, no flip it. Wait, I was going to uh, <laughs> turn several boxes. <laughs> Are you just going to keep doing that while I talk? Thank you. So, <laughs> I'm like, there are some you. Well, about that. I'm going to get out the way. All right. Let's take these boxes out. You got the other ones too? Mm hmm. There we go. Well, that's not like the thing in the well, Maybe not. Huh? So these are the boxes we have. I don't think I, I don't feel like any of these are on pop protectors. I don't know. We'll but see. we'll see. We'll see. All right. You get the first choice. I'll choose this one because it's closer to me. All right. And this, I don't think this box had any, um, Guaranteed yeah, that. but that's fine. It says pops of value will have pop protectors, but it's fine that, um, it's not guaranteed value because it was $13 per box. I mean, what do you expect at that point, you know? Yeah. So we will see. Do, do, do. All right. So. Is over at? Yeah. All right. So go ahead and check that out the box. Show the people first because they get priority. Mm -hmm. It's not especially protected, though. We'll just, we'll just come back. That's fine. Okay. All right. Uh, Ready to show the people? Um, yeah. All right. There we go. Hopefully it's nice. I, I don't so. know what was in this run besides the Michael Myers. So. <laughs> All right, let's see. Bruce oh. Wayne from Justice League. Um, it is the Batfleck version of Bruce Wayne from the Incredible Flop Justice League 2017. <laughs> kind of excited for the um the Snyder Cut though. Even if it's not very good, it's different than his original version. That's a 2017 summer. Convention exclusive. Mm -hmm. It's a shared sticker, but oh, he's holding a battering. Cool. I don't know if you noticed that. Oh, I didn't. Yeah, he's holding a battering. Oh, that's cool. See? Yeah, that's pretty cool, Pop. Nice Pop. Can't well, complain about quite that too much. expecting that. Yeah. We've only seen, we have only seen one other. No, actually, I don't think we've seen any Justice League ones, right? Because I was about to say one of the Wonder Womans we got was Justice League, but I don't think it was. I feel like we've seen something Justice League related. I don't, I don't know. Think so. We'll see. I don't know. Well, next one. Oops. This box is all weird, but oh. all right. If it's in a pop protector, I'm gonna just save it for last, you know, because mm -hmm. efficiency. Right. All right. So get all this out the way. Is this a pop protector? No, I don't think it is. Okay, so it's the. This is the side. All right. Okay. What is it? Hopefully if it's the collection, you know. Oh, it's always a plus, even if it's not a very value pop. It's always a plus if it's the collection. 
Right, right. All right, let's look. Okay, this is not for the collection. <laughs> Twilight yeah. Sparkle Sea Pony. It's a chase, though. It is, it is a chase, so, you yeah. know, that could be something. That could be something. But, yeah. Gotta love my little ponies. Yeah. Shout out to all the bronies out there. <laughs> but that's cool, though. It's yeah. Looks like, like kind of metallic. Not really, but like... It might be. It's, a, it's an interesting finish. I think it is metallic. Oh. I mean, it is a chase. It could be. All right. Third pop. Yeah. Next pop. Hopefully if it's a collection because the first two don't Not really. really fit my collection. But you know what happens. It happens. Yeah. But nice pops in general though. Yeah. Not bad. Can never really complain about that. Correct. Do, 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 All right. Oh. I didn't know you pulled it out. I kind of saw it. I, I think I know what it is. Hang on. <laughs> Put this box to the side. We'll see if my uh, my quick eyesight was correct for what it was. I guess we will. If it is, then I mean you would like the quote unquote franchise. Mm -hmm. I think I'm, yeah, this is this is the right side. Alright. Look at it, audience. Look at it. <laughs> Look for the collection. We'll see. If it's what I think it is, then it does not fit the collection. Alright, let's see. Oh, oh, it's not what I thought it was. I thought oh. it was. I thought it was another Michael Jordan pop. Oh, it is a Harley Quinn imposter. Looks like Batman, obviously in Harley Quinn's colors. That's mm -hmm. interesting. Who's, who's who is he going to fool with that? I don't know. <laughs> That's interesting. I have a few versions of imposter Batman. Mm -hmm. um, he is there as Two Face, Poison Ivy. Who else is on the back of here? Um, the Riddler, Scarecrow, the Penguin. So that's pretty cool. Yeah, that's pretty cool. That's nice. Nice pop. Two Batmans. Mm hmm. We've like unboxed Batman adjacent things, but not like, but nothing ever Batman. <laughs> and maybe it's because Batman just, you know, rare, or he just highly coveted. I don't know. It depends. There's a lot of Batman pops. A lot. I like to see some of them. There's a lot of grill ones too, but all right. Let me reach in here. Please be something magnificent. Yeah. It would be cool to unbox like a um, Batman issue one type of pop. I'm sure it exists. I don't know. That'd but probably be like. This is not a pop protector, so it's not anything crazy. No Michael Myers. <sighs> Unfortunately. Tough. But all right. There was like. What did I say? Like 400 boxes? Mm hmm So, all right. Let, I'm going to show the people. All right. I think this is a bobblehead. Because it's a bit wobbly. Bobble, bobble. Bobble, the bobble, the bobble, bobble. I'm <laughs> <laughs> about to say right. too. All right, let's look. It is Jim from the, from the office. office. Jim Halpert. It's actually not a bobblehead. He just has a really big head. <laughs> it's like a bobblehead. It's moving. No, it's not. Oh. And it would have said it oh, right well. here. Oh. So it's not a bobblehead. He's just, <laughs> just, just a, a big, big head. head. So, yeah. That is our Jen's third The Office pop. The Office. All right. So now let's check some value on these things. We're going to save the two stickers for last because they have stickers. Um, And we're going to do... Which one of these do you want to do first? We can do the Holly Quinn and Post. And right. popster. So keep in mind that these were thirteen dollars per box. Mm -hmm. So where are you guessing for him? I'm gonna say twelve. Twelve? I'm gonna say ten. Let's see. Let's see. This is nine dollars. Mm -hmm. So yeah, I, I figured it probably won't be that much, you know? Mm -hmm. Alright, so that one was undervalued. <laughs> Unfortunately. But you know, it happens. All right, now, Jim from The Office. What you thinking? 10. No, I was going, I'm going to say 10 also. So, Jim from The Office, just regular Jim. He is $11. Yeah. So, that was also under value. Tough. All right, well, maybe we can make up some ground here. Okay. We'll do the chase last. Let's do the... Bruce Wayne exclusive. So let me actually go to PPG because you know we need some accuracy, you know. 
Mm-hmm. So Bruce Wayne, this is uh, number 200. So what you thinking? 21. 21? I'm going to say 20. So Bruce Wayne, he is $11. Tough. What's the version that's worth 75? The, the one with the actual convention sticker. This is a oh. shared exclusive. Tough. Oh, so that was undervalued too. I think it's too good so far. Yeah, it's looking terrible. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> so now we have Twilight Sparkle Sea Pony. So how much do you think she's going for? I'm going to say 22. 22? I'm going to say 20 again. If this is undervalued, oh my God. It's we'll a suck. chase, so we'll see. We'll see. So she is... Ten dollars. That sucks. These were all undervalued. Oh my god. That is. This was bad. So yeah. Spent a total of sixty three dollars and seventy five cents and only got forty one dollars. Yikes. And two of two of these had stickers and they were still bad. <laughs> oh my god. That's that's um tough. First smile tough. Robux and you know it just didn't go great. Maybe, maybe because it was a lower one. Yeah. But I feel like every time we do lower ones that are like 15 or lower, we yeah. usually get pretty decent ones. But yeah. sometimes we might get one that's like $5, but for the most part, we get decent ones. So none of these were good. And these were four, these didn't come together. These were like four separate boxes. Yeah. Maybe just bad luck. But to be fair, there were, what, 400 boxes in this run. So maybe, yeah. maybe that's why. Maybe yeah. that's why. Bound to have some dip in quality with all those yeah. boxes. All right. Review time? Review time. All right. You want to go first? Um, The pops themselves are kind of cool. Don't don't care too, too much for my little pony. But it still is like nice, respectable franchises. But unfortunately, that is a massive um, loss in... <laughs> yeah, like $19. Yeah. So I would have to give it like... A 6.5. 6.5? Yeah. I was going to give it a 5. That's fine. Um, I don't... Actually, none of these fit my collection, mm-hmm. which obviously isn't something that's up to the company. Obviously, that's always something on my fault. But um, I always include that when I do my reviews. So none of these fit the collection. So that means I'm not going to keep any of them. So that that, that really sucks for me. Yeah. And on top of that, every single one was undervalued. <laughs> and I know there was no guarantee value, but still, like, still. like I like I mentioned, any other time with any other company where we've done like lower value boxes, they've been pretty decent. True. But this is like this is bad. Just poop. It was bad. Just keep it honest with you. Yeah. So I'm gonna have to give it a five. Same. Even with the stickers, they just weren't. <laughs> I thought maybe I was gonna save it a little bit. Like, at least be, like, 15 each or something. Maybe. And then it just didn't. They were both under. <laughs> yeah. Unfortunate. <laughs> yeah. Because this, this like, um, My Little Pony Pop, what was it again? It was, um... 10. This My Little Pony Pop we had was 10. Yeah. And it's a Chase version. And the regular version was only 8. <laughs> it's only a $2 difference. That is the the pop. Yeah, game. that that definitely sucks. But big time. All right, now that we unbox unbox all these Funko Pops, I have a gaming channel. Link is in the description down below as always. And anytime I reach milestones, I'll do giveaways. So you might see one of these pops in a giveaway. Make sure to stay tuned for that. That's gonna do it for today's video. Make sure to like and subscribe and leave a comment down below telling us your favorite pop that we unboxed today. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.